Today I'm doing a I'm replacing the axle or the boot So I'm taking off and to see if I can change it only the boot It'll be easier It's not that much expensive only the boot Otherwise it'll be more expensive It is 36 millimeter First I just I'll turn it just turn it Enjoy the video Take the suspicion, put the control and then do anything. To take the bolts, you need to hit it. There's a groove inside it because of that, it will not come off. the net first and I hit it. You will damage it. Into the book. So now we can put the axle. So um, I assembled this the brake lines. There are not any clips. The drain, if the oil drains, we can bring this in. Yep, rain. It's almost out. Yep, the oil 
almost ready. It's a brand new car, so I don't want to replace it. I don't know what to do. One bolt on put. After I get the axle, axle the boot, go and check it before the buy. Just put the bolts. It's over here. Is I think it is small crack, but. We're gonna replace it. There's another axle over here. Just want the whole axle over here. I need this. For now, I'll take. I take it and then if I can take this put it out, damage it. Let's see. Super special. It's nice. It is. Okay, and I can't use it back, but easy. So we're trying back. taking this side the clip because on that side there's no take off you need to hit it by air hammer because if that before I damage it let me take this guy otherwise buy the whole thing before I buy the whole thing I want to check this car Same as this one. Okay, I might take this one out. Might, might, might. Yep, this one can take it out. 
Yeah, okay, this one. Yeah, I believe we can take this one out. Okay, there is a clip over here, so that would be super great. And what I'll do this grease over here. So go buy a small screwdriver. the clip you can take it out so you don't need to this one need to air hammer it sometimes it will broke so it's better take from here I'm not broke oh, yeah, the clip this clip it's not too bad otherwise you can replace the whole thing it's hundred something I'll bring it out so be careful the grease too much. So put the grease back without replacing this boot. So now I'll take this one out. There's a clip down here. I'm gonna stop the grease everywhere. Put the glove you if you want to do, otherwise your hand will be messy. Okay. So there's a crease inside the boot, I can't leave it there. So there is a clip. Yeah. You don't need special tool for this clip. So there is a clip inside here. You only need a small screwdriver, maybe. Depends. Here it is. Let me turn it this way. Maybe two small screwdrivers. Yeah, maybe two screwdrivers. So I think the clip will be something like this. Kind of. Here it is, I think, same, same one, like a Toyota. Put it over here. Something, oh, this one, see? So we put it like this back over here. So now we can slide the boot out, so it'll be easier. Don't need to spend that much money. So already, I'm already in the grease, so let me take this boot out. Super easy, just slide it out and put this one over here. Don't replace that one, we're going to replace this one. I'm super dirty now. So I'll order OEM boots because it's not that much expensive the OEM. I don't know why it'll be here. Maybe OEM not aftermarket depends. Okay, we're out. So I'm throw this one away. For now I'll keep it. So I'll put this one back. I'm good in mess. 
So over there, there is no clip. You only air hammer it. That's why I don't break my camera in you. And then wear a glove. Otherwise, you'd be very lucky. It's better. If you have a glove. I'll show you to you later. Why you can't take it from there. You can take it. But if you damage it, you need to press the half the axle or the whole axle if you want to. You don't want to damage it again. Put it in. You could take it from there, but it's not safe. It's better to take it from here. Only two clips, then you slide it out. Okay, so I'll show you all later. So you can take it from here. The balls, it's different balls. You can put it. There's no clip around there, so because of that, if you wanna hammer it, it is around here. Sometimes you damage it. I don't recommend it. If you damage it, you buy this on this half at the axle. But if you take it from here, there's a clip over here, and there is clip inside here. I showed you before. So you can slide the boot and put new one and put this one back. It's easy. Only you change the clips. The clips you can find it anywhere from Amazon. You already want to buy. Okay. So we we'll order the boot. OEM if OEM come early, otherwise aftermarket is better. Well, it's for the transmission oil. Then not the transmission oil, it's not red, but here it is. This green. This. I'll put it this one later on. It's green. So maybe I'll put something inside there. So now I'll put this one inside the car. All right, I got a new boot. Here it is. If you want the park trimmer. They will give you the clips, the crease, everything. Here they crease. The boots. There's a clip inside it. So put it here. Then to do it. If you wear a glove, that would be good. Otherwise, you'll get a mess. Last time I don't have glove. So I get, I get a good mess. So I'll fill with. So I'll use my hand and then push it in. If you don't want to do this kind of, you can buy the whole axle. The easy way to do to save money is this way. So I will put whatever it is I didn't put to. So I did a good mess. If you have multiple glove, it is helpful. That's a worse. Okay, good mess. You want to make a good mess like me. Clean it by 
brake cleaner. So I need to put first the boot of clamp, different clamp. So to put it in, you need to turn it in. Okay, so I'll slide this one first, just slide in, it's not that much hard, just slide in. the clip oh, I think it screwdrivers The clip needs to fist over on this side, same side, this, it's not the same, this one getting in and getting out, so it is same size there is, so put on that side first, then continue the whole place to push it in. So you can see where it's going. Only three places should be holding the clip. There's only three places. And I try to take it off. Not that much hard, but so it's not coming off. So we good thing. So I'll put the foot back. Then I'll put flavor grease, and that's it. So there's a way to put it, the, the boot. Okay, so all boots in. It's kind of messy. Okay, now. So here's the what I use. You can buy it from Amazon. It's different kind of PC ones. So the bigger one is bigger one, and the small one, small one. But I'll cut it. This one's too big. I'll cut it around here. If the small one need to, I'll cut it both of them. I think I need this small one to, to cut it. I need to cut both of them to make it small. I will check the old and new one. So I'll put it in my hand, maybe around here. And I'll cut this part.
screws in. I need to squeeze all of them. Let me go in first. Alright. I'm going to put it back. If the O-ring's fine or not. Mm, that's fine. This new car, but I want to check it. Before I put everything back. They gave me this, but it doesn't matter if you put the old one. Let me try to open it. It's open. Okay. If I hammer it a little bit. If you want thick, you can take through it this way too. So I want to check. It is setting in 80 millimeter. the back the sensor okay and then for the brake light take this clip 